why I start every episode just rubbing my hands. I'm always so excited to bring this episode to you guys, or this series to you guys. I hope you guys are to watch it. We're going to get right into today's episode. There's a lot of, I guess comments and messages and really complaints from last episode that I want to address and talk to you guys about. Hopefully you guys think my uh, my Kevin De Bruyne Belgium kit is super sick. Now before we get fully into the episode, you guys, the first thing that you guys said in the comments of the last video is you really enjoyed me showing you guys how much we've raised throughout the month for the kids, for Make-A-Wish Foundation UK um, and for BC Children's Hospital. So there's the update. We're up to $7,977 raised for Make-A-Wish Foundation. And then through my donations uh, from, from subscriptions and stuff, what I push at the end of every single stream, we're now up to $4,477 raised for BC Children's Hospital. So we're doing incredibly well. We're gonna keep doing this all month long. If you guys again are inspired to donate or help out the kids in any way, shape or form, both the links to BC Children's Hospital and Make-A-Wish Foundation are both included in the description down below. So you can click there, donate, support however you want, do whatever you want. Don't feel, you know, pressured. Uh, to donate you can do something in your own time or you know to your own local charity but try and spread some Christmas cheer um, to help some people out I, th I think that's kind of the message here so anyways that's kind of the the little bit of accounting done here the little bit of messaging done here what I really wanted to get into boys is today's episode and I think a little bit of an update for you guys so this is the team that we finished off with on last episode loved using it very excited with it uh, some of these players have gone up in price which I'm happy about some of them have gone down in price thanks to the 100k packs that were available through the weekend so is what it is there's nothing nothing I can do here it's foot miss now so EA are pushing packs and stuff like that certain players I'm gonna make money on other players I'm not gonna make much money on but that's okay we're not gonna sell the team on for this episode in fact Depending on how we do, I don't even think we're going to use this team. What we're going to do, and this is kind of where the series I think is going to change a little bit, and I think you guys are going to enjoy it. We are going to turn the series, it's still going to be the poor man road to glory, but we're going to slightly shift the series into a butt draft to glory series as well. So we're still going to take any coins that we've earned just from playing games, from being the poor man essentially, where we don't spend any money on FIFA points or coins or any of that dumb shit. We just earn coins through either opening bronze packs, trading, investing in informs, playing the game and winning, playing offline games, all that stuff. But what I want to do is something that you guys have been begging me to do, which is start a foot draft series. So that's what we're going to do. Every weekend, we are going to do the foot draft on this series. Then in the week... It was, it was bound to happen. Hey man, just finished watching your FIFA 15 poor man RTG and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Continue the good work and God bless you, man. A very mad fish. God bless you, man. Thank you for the kind words and there you go. This is where it all started, right? In FIFA 15 with the poor man road to glory. But I think my ears just got melted there. Hopefully you guys, it wasn't so bad. But anyways, um... I think that that's going to bring an exciting twist and 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 like new injection into the series where we don't just risk doing the foot draft every once in a while but like you guys know that on the weekends every week we go into the foot draft we do a new team maybe you guys can let me know in the comments down below do you, we can do maybe some themed foot drafts today's foot draft I want to try and do like the best possible foot draft so if I get Ronaldo I think we're going to do a very BBVA contingent and try and win that son of a B because you know what at the end of the day this is the poor man road to glory I try I try to want to make I try to make coins or I want to make coins is what I'm trying to say here so we want to win it we want to get those good packs we want to pack good players that we either keep or sell on or whatever so I think that's what we're gonna do um Mo Diga thank you for the subscription dude the resubscription your subscription goes directly to BC Children's Hospital uh to help out the kids so thank you for the support so that's what we're gonna do smash the like button boys if you guys are excited about our plans for this series if you are do that and let me know in the comments down below if you're down with that let me know if you're not down with that. Fill me in in the comments down below of how you want this series to go, if you're happy with it, if you think this will be a nice change. I think it will be, so let's just get right into it. First things first, we gotta pick a bloody formation. And I don't see, this is where this is where I, I don't know what to do. Because I exclusively use on my main accounts and in my streams and stuff like that, in my challenge videos against other YouTubers, 4321 and 4312, that's it. As much as I wanna use false nine, it's not a great formation. It really is not a great formation this year. 
and we're trying to win games. So I was thinking actually 4-4-2 holding. Because if we get Messi and Ronaldo or Bale or whatever, we can put them out wide. They'll do just fine. Um, I'm actually thinking we do 4-4-2 holding. This is one of my favorite formations to use last year. I don't know if it's great. So it's either going to be, really, it's either going to be 4-4-2 holding, which could help us get some wins, or false nine. Dane, oh thank you for subbing, dude. Your subscription goes directly to charity as well. God bless. All right, let's just do this again. We, we did this the last time, and it worked out. Uh, 442 is not that bad. You know what? We haven't used 4... I'm just going to do it. You guys are going to get mad already in the comments and say I should use false 9 because I could get, you know, Ronaldo, Suarez, and Messi. But I'm going to go with the formation that, if I'm patient, I think will help me win. So let's do this one. 442. Come on, baby. Oh, I mean, when you get a Messi, oh my God, as much as I want to use Ibra, there it is, boys. We're going for the win. We're going for the win, so we're going to go with Leo Messi. Um, all right, let's work through this team. So what did we do the last time? I think the last time we worked through, th that was kind of the trick, right? We did reserves or we did the substitutes and then we went up to the strikers and stuff like that. And, and Okay, so let's do the same thing again. Let's start with the... Uh, forwards and see what we oh I isn't that side normally forwards why is there a center back and a goalkeeper in here have has EA changed it up that's odd um I might actually pick Howard here because we could go with a BPL defense and then a La Liga uh, strike force picking anyone else isn't gonna help me out at all so let's go with let's go with Howard here uh the other substitution oh Oh, 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 super bad. Um, I mean, that, you know, that gives us some chem with Messi, although this guy looks absolutely abysmal. Mkhitaryan would have been nice as well. Hard to work him into the team. All right, let's six foot two. You know what? He'll be able to receive some crosses and maybe some put some cheesy balls away uh, with this new update. Crosses and, and cheesy stuff like that is starting to work really well. Oh, my Lord. Ooh, do we stuff Ramsey in there at CDM? Uh, at left CDM? Maybe go with like a BBVA right side and a BPL left side? We could do that. We already have Tim Howard as well. Again, um, Erickson I would love, but he actually won't get much chem. So I'm thinking Inform Ramsey would be the right choice here. I'm thinking Inform Ramsey would be the right choice. Although Moutinho... You know, could link with Ronaldo, but that would just be hard, too hard to fit him into to a different team. So let's do that. Let's do that. And then the other technically... Ooh. Ooh, Costa has a super sub. Oh my god, Barkley's in for him as well. See, that's the problem with 442-2 is we've got the CDM. So center attacking mids don't get a link at all. He'll, he'll be on like four chemistry because I can't adjust his position down to a CDM, which is slightly disappointing. And again, we already have Messi, so Costa would be a super sub. Barkley would be a super sub. I honestly think Barkley in one of the CDM spots wouldn't be too bad. So maybe even using him as a super sub wouldn't be terrible. <laughs> all these right mids, man. They're not really helping me out all that much. Mm, um, that D. Mount Flurry, God bless you, dude. Thank you for the support. He's saying look at the Make-A-Wish Foundation page. You know what? Even though we're recording a video, let's do it, boys. This is about, you know, being inspired and trying to help out the kids and stuff like that. So let's have a little, let's have a looky-loo here um, and see if something's come through. <sighs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Mount Flurry with a hundred and eighty dollar donation! Hi Nick! Hashtag for the kids! Yo! Mount Flurry, God bless you, dude! Thank you for the support, man! Oh my word! And there you go, boys! This is us raising money for the kids during Christmas time. This is what it's all about. Fut draft, no fut draft. I'm hoping that I can use my, you know, my influence on YouTube and on Twitch to help out the kids. And Mount Fleury is stepping up like a big dog. Thank you so much, bro. Swedish Joker as well with a 20 pound donation. I'm looking at, you know, the ones that have happened very recently. And we have one more that I don't want to miss on the 19th here. Unbelievable. 10 pound donation. Um, there you go. From Nick2018. Someone donated to me and said, hey, can you push this on to the charities? And I don't want to do that. I want you guys to push all of the money directly to the charities. Please don't give me anything. I want you guys to help out the kids as much as possible, not me. Um, so that's that's his message there as well. God bless you guys. Thank you for the support. 8 
$1,266 raised so far. And a quick note as well. I've set a challenge that I don't know if we're going to hit it, but if we do, if we raise $10,000 for Make-A-Wish and $10,000 for BC Children's Hospital, by Christmas Eve, I will be dyeing my full beard. It's very thick. A lot of people have been wondering why I'm growing out my beard. It's hopefully for this cause. Um, I will be dyeing my beard all white for Christmas Eve's stream and for Christmas Day as well. So there's an extra challenge and a bit of, um, I guess, uh, what do you call that? I don't know what the proper word is, not um, uh, inspiration for you guys. Anyways, let's get back into it. I'm going to just use Barkley as a super sub there. Uh, we just need a good pull, man. We need something. Okay, so BPL backline is looking more like it. Now, Debushi would link. No, he wouldn't. He wouldn't at all, in fact. Oh, this is not working out, boys. This might actually end up being a BPL team, and then we just use Messi as a super sub. Um... Anyways, we gotta get lots of uh, lots of informs here. All right, that could be it. I mean, I, I feel like EA wants this. Ooh, Clichy or Moreno? Moreno would hard link with Skirtle, which would be super handy. Um, but Clichy is Clichy. You know what? I think I'm gonna go with Moreno because then again, this still gives us the opportunity to hopefully use Ronaldo up front or Neymar up front. You know what I mean? So let's go with Moreno. And then in goal, now at this point, it's going to have to be a... Oh, my sweet baby Jesus. Um, I guess we'll go with Shea Given as the as the, uh, the the next option. All right. So, for the time being, we have a BPL contingent over here-ish. Let's see what we can do up top. So, let's start with the right striker. See if we can get a Suarez or... You know what? I'll take a Griezmann. Ooh. But then we've got a Kane. Oh, I don't know. I'm always so bad with these choices. What do I do? What do I do? It, it, it just feels like EA really wants this to be like a, a full informed BPL team at this point. I'm thinking we go with Kane. Griezmann would allow me to use Messi as a starter, but Kane would just allow me to use Messi as a super sub. Uh, you guys are going to hate me so much. I think I think now I've just changed my mind. I think, I think this is going to be like the best... It's gonna have to be. RVP, are you like is Ian joking? Are these are they serious with this crap? Are they serious with this crap? Anyways, Manuel, thank you for the nine-month resub. That goes directly to charity for the kids as well, dude. Thank you. Now, had I went with Griezmann, he would have actually linked with Martial. So there's there's that. Um but anyways, I think I think we, at this point we go with Martial. I I Geniac's hero card, I love him, man. Such a good card. Uh so I think we're gonna go here. Okay, now this is going to be, I think this is going to be the decision maker here. Left mid. If there's a Ronaldo, we're going to pick him no matter what. But there isn't. Okay, so you know what? I actually think now I'm happy we decided to shift ourselves over to a BPL setup. Because we could use Sako. He actually looks pretty damn good as well. Um, mm, and now it looks like that, that we're just going to use Messi as a super sub. So we need a right mid from the BPL to give us that link. Zero Fox, thank you for the support, man. Um, he says, I would have kicked your ass if you hadn't gone with Kane. Oh, there you go, Zero. Thank you for the support, dude. We did go with Kane. So I think the only thing I do is probably swap them around like that for the time being. Let's see what we get at CDM here. Uh, this is actually going to be a great team. I'd like to go with someone like Diara. You know, we could kind of link them up pretty well here. But, oh, the Canadian dream. How did I not even... You are me and I am you. Both Canadians showing love even though, you know, we're, we're now officially Belgian. So I guess that doesn't count. Let's just go with Ramirez. I forgot. I'm Belgian until the end of the Euros, boys. Um, all right. Okay. Okay. So we've got... We've got... Oh my God. So many options. Do we use... Do we pick Krykoyak as a super sub? Not someone that's going to make it into the team, unfortunately. I think we go with Inform Krykoyak. And at that point... He becomes a super sub. Yo, dude, this is a sick BPL team. I think this is this is probably one of the best possible BPL teams I could put together. You know I'm never going to get, like, you know, the big, big, big dog players like, like Hazard and whatnot. But so far, so good. All right, this will be interesting. What are we going to get at right back here? We need BPL. This is where we won't get... Where we will get BPL. Okay, super boring. We're going with Nathaniel Klein, Leo Messi. You are going to be... Um, brought on almost instantly oh my penis 
Now, I want... This is the third in form. This is the team of the group stage, Diego Godin. Very tempted to bring him on. Again, just have him as a super sub. But I only have Skirtle. If I get Mangala, then we're set. I, I gotta think of some super subs as well, right? But anyways, I think I'm gonna go Mangala just for the... For the... For the links and all that. Now, Shawcross is okay. But Mangala is gonna be my left center back. And he's very good this year. They, you know, the fact that they fixed up his work rates has made him... Uh, very, very usable this year. All right. BPL team it is, boys. See? Very happy. I, very, very, very happy I went with uh, Mangala because there you go. We didn't get a BPL, another BPL center back here. None of these guys matter. They're all going to... I don't think any of, one, any of these guys are even going to make it into the substitute. So, for the time being, we'll swap over here. Got Skirtle. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Not really anyone else. I would love to get an Amavi, honestly. Like, Gibbs, Gibbs is, Gibbs is the choice, but I think we go with Moreno. Pace is gonna, Pace is gonna mean a lot, um, especially with people spamming down the wings now with the new updates, sending in crosses and stuff like that. Okay, let's see, goalkeeper, someone better than Howard? Oh my good god, okay. Basically, the three best BPL goalkeepers, really only missing Petr Cech, um, but... Spoiled for choice. Now I've used Thibaut Courtois a lot. He's okay. He's good. Neuer would be nice as a sub, but Neuer, you're gonna get ignored. Hugo Lloris is okay. I haven't used David De Gea very much, and I really want to see if he's a good goalkeeper. So I'm gonna go with David De Gea. A lot of you guys um, will be very surprised at my choices of the team of the year uh, players that I think are gonna make it. Um, I did a team of the year prediction video that will be out tomorrow for you guys. I put a lot of effort into it, so hopefully you guys are excited for that. Um, David De Gea is, you know, in that video. So I think you guys will, um, you'll enjoy the choices and the conversation that we have in the video. Now, we need a BPL right mid, or even a BPL like center mid that we could just put on at right mid off of Kem. Otherwise, this team is pretty sick, man. Um, this team is- Whoa! Sweet Jesus! That's exactly what we needed. Now, that is not the best possible Ronaldo. In fact, that's only the first in form Ronaldo. But, I mean, I would be a tit if I didn't if I didn't pick him. So, Ronaldo will be a sub. The dream is there. Oh, my God. And and the, the, beautiful, the beautiful irony here is that we needed a right mid. And we got probably the best right mid other than maybe in form Willian in the BPL right now. Fuck, this is almost a, well, not a full in form BPL team, but we're getting there. Definitely getting there. If only I could stuff Barkley at right center mid, I, I would have put him there to get another inform in. Um, okay. At this point, oh my god. Do we just get Neymar, Messi, and Ronaldo and use them as super subs as we need them? What do you guys think? Di Maria is great. Really fun card to use. Um, really, really fun card to use. I'm thinking, I think if we go Neymar, god. EA just, EA just loves giving us the good cards, man. All right. Whoa. Mmm. 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 Lewandowski uh, as a sub as well. You know, having Ronaldo and Lewandowski up front with maybe like Neymar and Messi or like bring on Neymar one time, Messi another time. I think that would be great. Petr Cech would be good. If I didn't get a great goalkeeper, Petr Cech would be in there. But David De Gea, um, I think he's just going to stay in net. Honestly, we've got too many goalkeepers. I think Lewandowski. If we need a big dog striker to make a difference, we got to bring on. That's a second in form Lewandowski, I believe. I packed his 90 rated third in form or team of the group stage. So we'll do that. And well, of course, the last one's always going to be shit. The yet another, you know, Dutch young winger that becomes the biggest disappointment on the face of the earth. Um, you know, it looks like Depay is following in his footsteps as well, along with Royston Drenthe and everyone else. Hopefully Quincy Promise doesn't do that. Um, I think we go with the tree. This guy's still, what, how tall? Like 75 feet tall? There you go, six foot eight. Okay. Um, so I think here we replace Given. I think we replace Juru. I think we replace you. We're just not even going to get into the team. And then, honestly, I don't think I'm going to be making any defensive substitutions, really. Extra time might be intelligent to have, you know, Kieran Gibbs in there if my players run out of gas. But, I mean, I don't know. I think I think this is the best. This is a really nice... This is a really nice foot draft, honestly. I'm very excited. Now, let my uh, OCD take over here. 
and we'll adjust everything from highest to lowest on the bench. I don't know why I do this. There's no explanation for it. I've been doing this again since Ultimate Team 10. Um, so I'm not, yeah, I'm not, not changing anytime soon. There we go. And then oddly enough, these guys are all highest to lowest as well. So that's cool. Okay, so this is the team we'll obviously start off with. I'm thinking Ronaldo comes on at striker uh, at some point. Or, or you know what? Maybe we just bring Ronaldo on at left mid. You know, not take off these guys right away. Um, especially if they're doing well. I think, actually, we bring on Ronaldo at left mid. Maybe we could bring on Messi for one of these two. Maybe even Neymar for one of these two. Um, and then maybe bring in a midfield substitution. Like, put Messi in here. If, if, if Ramsey isn't doing well. Or put Messi in here if Ramirez isn't doing well. Yo, man, I'm excited. This is, this is really good. This is really bad. Um, I mean, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't affect any of the starting 11, so it is what it is. I like Andrea vs. Boas, so I'm just going to pick him for no reason at all. I think everyone is good to go here. So, there's the review on the FUD draft. Messi. It's kind of, kind of cool. 184 rating. Not bad. I'm super excited about that, man. I think, I think we got a great team. Again, there's the FUD draft, uh, stats for you guys. We've only won two on this series. The new Poor Man Road to Glory slash draft to glory series that we're doing now so hopefully we can have a nice little run here i think all that's left to do is we get into our first game well if you guys noticed the quality was a little bit crap in the intro to the video hopefully it's better now unfortunately that entire intro didn't record i had to pull it from my twitch stream and export it to youtube then download it then include it in the video and all that crazy stuff so I apologize if the quality wasn't perfect for you guys. Um, now you should have a near HD quality. There's the first game of the stream. The first game of the FUT draft. And watch us get knocked out first round. Oh shit. Whoa! What was that? Why did he LT that? Come on, man. Okay. Okay, patience as well. I need to remember that 442, I can't force anything. I have to take my time. Um, pull them out of position here. Wow, Kane. Let's slow this down. Come on, Nick. I can't force it. I need to, I need to allow my... That's offside, right? Is that offside? I don't know if it was. Uh, I need to allow my wingers to get in the game here. Is that my winger? Is that Sako? It is. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Pulling them apart a little bit. This is good. Of course, of course he gets the block in. See, this is the problem with the 4-4-2 setup is, uh, is, yeah, it's definitely going to not have the options through the middle that I would want, like right there, but that worked out. That came. That was such a bad touch. This guy is enjoying his balls. The ball rolls. Okay. So the question is, who is the bad player? You know what I mean? When your buddies are playing FIFA, there's always someone that has a, you know, someone that's terrible at the game and someone that's a bit better. So we got to discover who the bad one is. Oh, Ramsey, get that pass off to Shakiri. This is bad. Yes. Okay, well, he's got the ball back somehow. That's out of bounds. All right, so substitution should be coming here. Cristiano will be on as well. See who he's uh, who he's bringing on. Okay, or is it only going to show? Oh my God! So this is my opponent. They're bringing on Cristiano Ronaldo, Thiago Silva, and Pirlo. Now I would love if EA would confirm about our our thoughts with the foot draft. Like, am I playing someone that could potentially be in the final right now, or are we both? playing in the the first round ramsey ramsey oh he got a late block in okay let's go boys please oh, please oh was that the wrong choice should i have taken a touch there with martial not sure oh boom Oh, man. Things are falling for me, and I'm not making the right decisions here. Come on. See if we can get this to Martial. Near post. OP. Just kidding. Cristiano. Near post. OP. Come on, Diego Alves. How are you making these saves, man? Not like this, EA. Don't do us dirty, EA. Wow, that was awful. Oh! Uh, should I let this go out of bounds? I'm going to let it go out of bounds. Yeah. Okay. Let's try this again. Now, I think they're expecting me to go short. So, who's that at the top of the box there? 
No, you pleb! I don't know! I don't know! I can't score! Was there was there sweat available there that I completely missed? Foul, 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 foul! Okay. Come on, Martial. Make that run for me, buddy. No, Nick! Your decision-making is a joke! What are you up to, bro? Yes! Okay. It's a foul. Do I take that? I don't know. Oh! Is it a pen? Thank you! Thank you! Oh, just trying to pass that up to Ronaldo. I, I mean, Ronaldo didn't go down, so let's have a look here. This is the problem with the patch. Oh, wait, no, he took out Aaron Ramsey. I thought the penalty was for uh, that slide tackle on Kane. Are you drunk, dude? I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. It's going to have to be Cristiano. If Alves saves this... No, fucking... He did... I... I... Oh, my God, dude! Wow! What am I doing? Oh, this is so bad. First game of the day, and we're bottling it, boys. So much, so much for the draft to glory, guys. So much for the draft to glory. Oh my god. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I don't even want to look at the comments or the chat because I know how much abuse I'm getting right now for missing that. Oh, baby girl! No, Nick, you suck! You're so bad! I've had so many opportunities, it's almost disgraceful now. That'll be a foul, too. Wow, what a soft foul to give away. What a soft foul to give away. Oh. Seriously. What do we got here? What do we got here? That's dangerous. Okay, maybe I'll get a little break here? Before the before half, I think Ronaldo needs to be put up front, man. Um, I think Ronaldo. I, I I hate to say this, but I don't find Harry Kane to be that useful. In fact, look at that! Look at the halftime stats, boys. Gusta Luca, thank you for the support, dude. Um, Sup, Nick? Keep the good work. Remember my team from yesterday? I did this. Should I change? I'm gonna try that. I don't know how that's gonna work. But Shakiri is pretty damn strong, and he's left-footed. So I think bringing him into the midfield with Messi out wide could work uh, to my benefit. What what could this guy be doing? They've already done three subs, anyways. So in case you guys have missed it, wait. Does the uh, you know what would be a better view of this is right here because we could look at his goalkeeper's ratings. There you go. So this is how I've set the team up. Um, I think it's I think it looks pretty damn good. And then this is how my opponent set the team up. So Neymar Suarez up front. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what else he could be changing around. His, did his Alves have a 10.0 rating? All right. Yes! What a do! Oh my god, I don't even know what I was going to say there. I, don't, I honestly, I was about to say what a great goal, and then what a dickheaded goal all at the same time. I bamboozled my own brain, but there we go, boys. That's how we start it. Ronaldo pulls it wide, makes it one nothing. Thank you, Jesus. Freaking Alves with a 10.0 rating. I think we deserve a one nothing lead at this point, especially considering I've already missed a penalty. Boom! fall to anyone else oh my lord alberto moreno though doing work man i think this is the friend that isn't the greatest uh, at the game which is good thank god thank god because his uh his buddy is is good so um i just need someone like that yeah you 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 keep pulling guys out of position bro oh shakiri Okay. I don't like this one nothing lead, boys. But I do. Fuck. No. Oh, that's his friend making a mistake. And then I make a mistake instantly after. Come on, Nick. 
Oh, I'm, I'm holding on to possession too much, man. Wow, boys. Come on. Leo versus Ronaldo. Leo wins that battle, thank goodness. Are you fucking for real? Who would, who would ever want to cross it like that? Anyways, we are getting lucky. We are getting freaking lucky right now. Come on. There it is. Boys, I mean, I'm going to start losing my shit. I'm going to start losing my shit. All of a sudden, my players aren't making any passes. Like, you guys all know where I wanted that pass to go initially, right? Like, why would I force that to a guy that's perfectly marked? Here we go. Okay, Ronaldo stopped running, but I think I can get there. Ronaldo versus Ronaldo. Ronaldo wins. Oh! oh so much risk okay you know what man i'm winning and i'm f i'm trying to force myself another goal like slow it down nick you guys look at that pk is now completely like out of the game completely out of the game all i needed to do is be a little what a bad pass from oh hello Honestly, is Diego Alves the best goalkeeper in this game? Oh, oh Ronaldo! Is, is this? Is, is... There are no words. There are zero words right now to describe. Oh my god. I bet you that won't count as a save or as a shot because uh, um, Alves saved it onto the post, didn't he? That'll count as a save. Oh, of course, man. Rip. Here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna break his leg. This is bad. This is fucking really bad. I don't know who to... No. Oh! Just clear it! Just get rid of it. Oh, my lord! Wow! We escaped there, boys! Come on, man. That's a simple pass for Ronaldo. Keeper, keeper, please. All right. Somehow we escaped, boys. I don't know how, but we did. This is tough, though. With two players, they cover so much extra... Yo, man! That's a simple pass! That should be an easy pass for Ramirez, but it's not... Oh, God. His friend's going to do all the work and get a goal here. Or a penalty. I don't know, actually. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, my God. Such a heavy pass. Did he save that shit? Oh, my God. Dude, no. This is insanity. This is insanity. He saved that, and then Martial missed an open net header. Oh my god, dude. It's it, it feels like it's written in the stars for this guy to get an equalizer, doesn't it? Because I've been playing so bad. I missed a penalty. No, it's it's dude. It's I'm gonna I'm gonna I mean, he's gonna equalize. It's just he is. He is. I can feel it. Yes! Oh, that was probably the game-saving tackle right there. Sick passing, guys. Wow. Really good. Really, really great passing. Two minutes of added time is actually going into about seven hours of added time at this point. He's going to get an equalizer here. God bless you. God bless you, Inform Skirtle. That has to be the end of the game, you pleb EA. Okay. How is this still two minutes of added time here? How? How did I just make it 2 nothing? This is what, 97 minutes now? Has to be. FIFA Roy, thank you for the resub. Your resub goes direct to charity. And what, are they going to rage quit now in the 90th minute as well? And be vaginas? What are they? Why did they just pause the game? 90th minute. So actually won't show us when that goal was scored. How is the game? Holy crap. Let me go look at the... Uh, I mean, I've, uh, come on, man. We deserve that win. Anyone else in the in the comments that says I don't? Like, 13 saves, 9.6 rating. Sure, I need to work on my finishing, as we all know. But let's have a quick look here at uh, the stats. Oh, my God. So here are the stats for you, first of all. Okay, so there, there are the stats. 
Look at look at where my shots were as well. Like all were pretty much inside the box. Second of all, please, can I see what Neymar's when Neymar scored? Oh, it only shows the 90th minute. It doesn't actually show you. Last year, EA used to show you the amount of added time that you scored, and I swear to God, we scored that goal in like the 96th minute. Anyways, I think we can get into our next game. Oh, fuck draft. How I love thee. Game two, boys. Ronaldo at striker, so this guy's pushing him up there right away. I like the team. Um, now, there's quite a few guys off of chem. The big ones that may be to my advantage is Zaba and Gigi's in form. So... I'm actually kind of excited. Now, usually I do poorly against shit chem teams, but fingers crossed, maybe this guy just doesn't understand footy in any way, shape, or form. Nice. Ooh. Foul. What's that? Oh, thank you. Okay, let's make a... I'm going to make my, my first sub here right away. Um, so I, I don't kind of... I don't want to be a turd... A turd nugget um, right off the bat. So we'll bring Ronaldo on just at left center mid for the time being and then and then we'll do the we'll do the we'll do the swap around after that do you think he brought anyone on i don't really actually pay attention where is ronaldo oh he's there okay let's try and swing this in the penalty box that's perfect <laughs> that was exactly what i wanted okay this guy oh no he definitely knows what's going on wow where was my defense there? Holy shit. It's foul. My own players fouled each other, so it's not really going to be called, Nick. Okay, this guy knows what's up. Come on, Nick. It's going to be a tough game. Oh! God, Harry Kane is a bumbling buffoon. What? the hell uh, okay oh my sweet jesus really that i mean if that's not a foul i don't know what is you know what boys the new update just go kill people in this game nothing gets called ever oh my god ronaldo you forgot the ball dude boom oh no man i thought for sure that was a goal off the crossbar come on um oh, shit am i playing two players again feels like it no no this is really bad oh my god fingers crossed maybe this guy just doesn't understand footy in any way shape or form just doesn't understand footy. Oh, we're down one nothing already, man. Just after we had that chance that we should have put away as well. Oh, I don't like it, dudes. I don't like it, man. He knows how to spam Ronaldo, that's for sure. Come on, boys. We gotta we gotta weather the storm here. This isn't good. No, oh, come on, boys. Are you serious? Like, what is this? Yeah, he's just he's, he's just gonna force the ball to Ronaldo. I, I, hey, yo, man, I don't blame him. I would too. I mean, I do too. You know what, boys? We gotta make one more substitution here. I'm not gonna bring on Messi just yet, but like, I gotta get Ronaldo up front. Kane is such a liability, man. Um, it, in my opinion, anyways, in this team. So we'll bring on Neymar at left mid, and we're pushing Ronaldo up the field because this is not not the way I wanted the team to perform. I need to make it like I need to make a move now. Before I start dropping more, um, more goals. Come on. Nah, that's bad. Why would you slide tackle there? Reddit, though. Thank God. Okay. Ronaldo has not moved up the field. Have you guys noticed that? Is that just because the, uh, the substitution still hasn't been made? Oh my God. Wow. Wow, what was that for a pass? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Shakiri! You should be able to catch Neymar, though, for the love of God. This guy loves the good old sprint dribble. Oh my God, this is so awful. Pass it faster! Please! This is imperative, man! Wow. Wow. 
that's the foot drop for you though boys it, it's it's always so much more easy than um than the regular game to me anyways here we go okay all right Still no break in play either for my substitutions to take effect. So I'm feeling like at this point, we're only going to get the substitutions at halftime, which sucks ass. But. Oh my god, man. Fuck, dude! Ronaldo! This guy is so good with this freaking Ronaldo! He just doesn't understand footy. My substitution still. Wait, well, that was Di Maria. Never mind. But still. My substitutions have just not taken effect. Yo, they look exactly the same from far away. Let's be real. Same boots, same haircut. Yay! Now we've got Ronaldo on the field. Uh, or up the field. Now that we're down to fucking nothing. Oh no, boys. The foot draft. The foot draft to glory is already dead. No! Please, God, no. What is this, man? Oh my Sweet Jesus. Oh, that was better. That was better. Right at halftime, I, you know what? I'm just trying to concentrate here. I don't want to be negative. I don't want to get down on myself just yet. This guy's a really good FIFA player. I like to think I'm okay at the game. But this guy is is much better. Oh, for the love of all that is holy... Come on, boys. At halftime, it would be really nice to get a goal here. Oh. I like to think I can still make a comeback here, boys. Not much to show you guys other than the two goals he scored and then, you know, I well, I guess the chance that I had. There you go. He's just more clinical than me. As you guys saw from the first game, I need to work on my finishing now almost more than ever. I, I, I think since the new patch, I'm even worse now at finishing. So, Ramsey, I didn't even feel in the game at all, again. So, we're going to sub him out, put Shakiri in his position, and just going to bring on Messi here. See if that helps out. Uh, I might have to go on attacking, though. Uh, I might have to go on attacking here. That's a sick play! Oh, my lord! How did he get that block in without causing a penalty there? Not like it matters. I would have missed the penalty anyhow. But come on, man. I need a little break here. How is this guy so fucking good at sprint dribbling? Oh my god, dude. I feel like I'm playing a pro FIFA player right now. Actually, in, in since this patch, I haven't come up against someone that can control the ball so well on the sprint. Oh, what a bad pass. Come on, boys. This can't be the end. Is he really gonna is he actually gonna waste time? Is that, is that what we're doing here already? Well, as uh, as we said, boys, toughest game yet, probably all year, against the guy that's team what is on how many chem? How many how many chems is? I am just the worst. Come on, it's it's still there, man. Wow. Oh my God, it's so ugly. Ronaldo, keep running into the open space, brother. You were right there for the love of all that is holy. Just keep moving into that space. I tried to play you in. I really did. Again. Oh my god. Oh my god. This guy is all, it's just almost too good. Like everything he does is perfection. Defending his decisions when it comes to defending. Oh, for the love of Christ. Wow. Wow. Honestly, this guy may be one of the best FIFA players I've come up against. He is stomping me here. Oh my god! Why you always do this? Of course that's a foul. Of course it's a foul. Ronaldo gets bullied and outpaced by fucking Ryan Shawcross. Sick. Sick work, guys. Come on. Fuck's sakes, man. 
Boys, like, what? Do I gotta go on ultra attacking? I mean, unfortunately, uh, the failure in, in the formation now is coming through as well. Um, being down two goals, this formation is so defensive. It's not even where I fucking wanted it, man. Oh my gosh. Oh my lord. Anyways, the failure in this formation is that it's too defensive. So being down um, by this many goals... Oh my penis! What a goal from... Okay, we've made it actually somewhat interesting. What a shot from Inform Martial. Takes the just most insane touch. <laughs> okay. You know what, boys? As this song comes on, there's hope. Nope, just kidding. the momentum whatever the hell you want to call it has just freaking brought it oh god no you fucking idiots not from kickoff please oh my god how has this happened please nick can you make the comeback of dreams happen can you make the comeback of dreams happen please please nick oh, fucking i gotta coach myself like like i'm freaking alex ferguson oh my god okay come on cristiano Oh, eat a dick, Ryan Shawcross! How am I not faster than you? How am I actually not faster than Ryan Shawcross? What? I could not outpace him. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Goalkeeper, 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 goalkeeper. Yes, boys. Does De Gea not have long... Th what the... F De Gea. De Gea. No, no, no. Why are you guys running into each other? Oh my god! No! No! Oh, I thought it was in. Oh my god, man. No! Look at my defenders! They're all just running into each other like vagina. Some for some reason I thought EA the EA gods would allow that to happen. Oh my god, okay. Holy shit, somehow. Somehow we're we're still in with a shout here. Come on, skirt. What the fuck is my team doing? I have to go short. No, you fucking idiots. Oh my god, really? depressing end to the episode so that's the end of it unfortunately um i'll do this guy this guy at the end of the day i'm sure the comments are just gonna get angry and rage and do as they always do but this guy was better than me at the end of the day um you know we made a valiant comeback and then i think my defending the scripting and the, the team itself let me down right at the end there where his name are just sprinted through and both all of my defenders just ran into each other fell all over the place um and he put it in you know what at the end of the day, it's all about trials and tribulations, boys. You know, I'm not going to win every single draft. We've won two on this account already. Um, and we're not going to, you know, we're not going to win every fight draft. There are the ratings as well. Not all that bad. His Buffon on, what was it? Four chem made eight saves. My De Gea did good, even though he's on full chem. Um, his Ronaldo on four chem got man of the match with the goal and an assist like a king. So at the end of the day, we're not going to win every single fight draft. It just is the way it is. If you guys, you know, are hopefully still supportive of the series, smash the like button. We'll bring it back next episode. Maybe have a YouTuber on uh, for next episode. Maybe not. Depends on how things work. But there'll be a squad builder, divisions. Get ourselves prepared for... Um, 
for Fut Draft over the next weekend. If I don't talk to you guys or, you know, release a video by Christmas time or after Christmas time, I hope you guys have a great Christmas. You know, show your family, your, your loved ones some love. It's a great time of year and I hope you guys are able to enjoy it. Whether it's with family or, you know, maybe you're not close with your family and it can be with your friends or maybe it's with your cat. Whoever you decide to share your Christmas or the holidays, or if you don't celebrate it, whoever you decide to share the next few days with, you know, I hope um, it's fun and enjoyable. And to finish off the episode, we're gonna open what can only be pile of garbage packs. So we started with 45,000 coins, right? Let's see where we go here. Let's see where we go. We could, I mean, we could still get something big. Um, nope, nope. Uh, this, 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 uh, this, we will store and then list at a later date to make, uh, some money back. So that was terrible. Um, let's see, let's let this one run. Let me know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Again, I apologize for the video, the quality being crap, uh, at the beginning of the video. There's unfortunately nothing I can do to improve that, uh, or fix it any more than I did. So hopefully you guys can allow that to, uh, to pass. Hopefully that'll be the last time it ever happens. All of those things I will list up on their own. I just don't want to waste your guys' time in the video to do it. Uh, discard all of that. And finally the jumbo pack here. Come on, EA. The trolling was real there. Feel free to give me someone that'll just cover the pack. Oh my god. Really? Ooh. Okay. Hold on a second here. That, this isn't as bad as I thought it would be. So... He might sell for a little bit. None of these guys will. Danilo, no. Cole might sell for a little. And Mario Ruiui might sell. All these guys will sell. That'll sell. That'll sell. None of that'll sell. That will keep. All right. So it looks like we've lost a solid 8,000 coins off of that. Five. Maybe. You know what? No, because we're up to 36K. Um, almost 37k. So really, even right there, we're already at 8,000 coins, you know, that we've only lost. Once I sell everything, you know what? Even though that FUD draft didn't result in any big players, I think we've only lost about 5,000 coins from it. So, not the end of the world. Love you guys. Thank you for watching it. I look forward to next episode and hopefully have an episode without any hitches or issues. Catch you on the flip side. Peace!